Sometimes in Excel, we're so quick to delete data that we think that we might not need. And then it turns out after we labor and we put all this effort into our worksheet that we really needed that information that we deleted. And so a better way to make that information kind of disappear from the worksheet without actually losing it is to hide columns and rows. And so, for example, here I have this H column. Maybe I'm not sure if I'm actually going to need Fort Pierce in this data. I could delete it. Just right click and do delete. Or instead of doing that, what I can do is hide. So if I right click column H and I click hide, notice it goes GI. And if you look very carefully, it's just a little bit thicker between those two columns. It's telling me that that information's hidden. Now you could put your cursor in between here and double click to make that come back. Or if you highlight the surrounding columns and right click and click unhide, it reappears. But you can do that from a lot of different places. Let's look here at this Lowe's. Maybe I don't care about may through july so if i select those three rows and i right click i can select hide and now that information is not visible to me anymore i haven't deleted i still have that information but it's not visible to the eye some practical applications i know some people that hide columns and rows that contain formulas and functions just to try and pull them out of the spreadsheet so that somebody doesn't play around with the formulas there are a lot of great uses for hiding, but often it's a better alternative to deleting information.